everyone, it's Deborah. Today we're going to talk about this new cosmetic organizer that I got and I apologize in advance for the wind. It may take my voice away. So I was looking at my makeup table which I got from Ikea and I got the seven drawer system too and it's I, I want to be able to dust and clean the top of my makeup table without having to take everything off. So I saw this off of another YouTuber site, Lisa Lisa One. I've been watching her for a long time and this is what she bought, or it's similar to what she bought. Now, what makes this different, it was only like $19 from Amazon, is these are adjustable because nothing is so annoying as to get an organizer where you may have a tall bottle and you can't get it in there. So this is four removable shelves, 15 slots, six tiers. So I will show it to you. And it came packaged very nicely, as you see. Now, as I guess you're putting it together, you can keep adjusting it until you're satisfied. It looks fairly easy. But again, it has a brush holder. That's important. Since it's not put together, I'll just show you the box. Brush holder, adjustable shelves, and it has this beautiful little diamond at the top and the bottom. And I got it very cheaply from Amazon. So here is a picture again. It's the rotating, which is important too. You don't want to make up organizer that's stationary because you're, you're constantly moving the whole thing. So this is kind of cool that it rotates. So I hope you guys check that out. And um, I finished my flower boxes and I think I will show them to you. Um, well, I had to water them so they're looking a little bit sad because I had to sit on my deck for three days so I'll show them to you when, when they start you know looking a little bit happier I still have much more planning I got so dirty from the potting soil I had to get in the shower so my last two videos I put up for some reason are not monetized and I don't I don't get it I haven't used any of those derogatory words or whatever, so I'm going to have to, like, do a manual review on them. Uh, you know, I don't get it. I see other YouTubers whose uh, videos are monetized, and they are, like, uh, d d pretty disgusting, and, and they're talking, you know, with foul language and everything. But Easter is this Sunday. I'm not ready. I thought it was a month away, but this is what happens when you go on vacation for a month. You lose a month. So I just got new homeowner's insurance with a company called Lemonade. You like my ponytail? Yeah, Lemonade. Um, it's fake ponytail. I already did a video on that. Okay, simple, simple to put it on. Just takes a second. Yeah, I, I had travelers with uh, Geico and it was like $45 a month and it was for half of what Lemonade has given me. Now I did the research, it's under Lemonade.com. They do everything on the internet and it, it is a whole different way of looking at insurance. So read up on it, don't listen to me, do your own research. But I have got now double the coverage and for half the money, you know? So that is great. So I appreciate all you guys, and I'm um, getting ready to go to the Berg, and uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm really enjoying this ponytail. It costs like $18, and you just clip it on. Yeah, so I'm getting excited for um, the summer. I'm going to enjoy this summer. I didn't last summer. I worked all the holidays. I worked Christmas, New Year's. Mother's Day, Father's Day, so um, the grass is turning green, and uh, I just noticed a trick with my uh, 
dip brow, you know, I think it's from Anastasia. It was getting hard and I did close the top every time, but I put a little drop of uh, Josie Moran's Argon Oil in it. And let me tell you what, it did a really good job, if you wanna see. I mean, it just, it just revived it back, you know. So my friend is in Ocean City and I wish I was there. Uh, I usually do go in April, yeah, uh, but it's very windy on the boardwalk and that's when you get the best deals in Ocean City in April because you can get like four t-shirts for $10. But I prefer now to go when it is a little warmer. But I already had my vacation, yeah. But when you're in your 60s, every day should be a vacation. Bye everyone.